I'd like to introduce you to the Virtual Microscope Explorer program. The program consists of a 3D interactive microscope that has the basic functions of a real microscope and reads images created with a $30,000 research microscope. To view a specimen, you simply click on one of the names in the list, and let's check out the monkey trachea. And when we do that, the, an image pops up in this window that views the specimen as you would see with your naked eye. To load the slide onto the stage, we cl click View Slide, and the slide flies out of virtual space and locks onto the stage. And just like a real microscope, we have to turn the light on by clicking on the power button at the base and focus the microscope by putting the hand on the focus knob and simply mousing down. And when the specimen comes into focus, we can view the magic mode, which shows labeling of salient features of the specimen. Here we can see the, the uh, epithelial layer and the hyaline cartilage very well. This is a very low magnification. We can't see much cellular detail. So let's put our hand on the right side of the microscope and click two times. That's one time. I'm going to click again, and we will go up to the 20x magnification objective, and we need to focus again. Now when it's in focus, we can view the image with the large mode where we see the whole thing. So now we see a lot more detail than we did at those, the low power. And uh, again, we can look at the magic mode and where the, the salient features of this image are labeled. Here we see the cilia, ciliated pseudostratified columnar epithelium, the basement membrane, capillaries, fibroblasts, this fibroblast nucleus, the loose connective tissue, and the hyaline cartilage matrix, and the chondrocytes that secrete the matrix. We have an autofocus feature that we can click so we don't have to focus between each magnification objective. And we'll let's look at the 40x magnification objective image. We click on the right side of the objective holder and it rotates to the 40x objective. Then we can click large and see the whole image for this specimen. Here we see a lot more detail. This was a 40x oil objective used to uh, create the image. And we can see the cilia very clearly at this point. So I hope you've enjoyed this brief tour of the Virtual Microscope Explorer program.